We know consumerism is on the rise, but it hasn't truly materialized. This has been due to a lack of transparency, personalization, and health plan restrictions. In 2017, we think we'll start seeing that change. As consumers in a post-Obamacare world, we're going to become more directly exposed to costs through health savings accounts and high deductible plans. We'll be empowered to choose plans and providers that we think will give us the most value. So providers need to be thinking more broadly about the total patient experience. Is your website easy to use? Do you offer virtual appointments? Do you have enough parking? Are patients easily able to understand upfront costs? We also expect new state laws to be enacted that protect and empower consumers to increasingly become more in control of how they're spending their healthcare dollars. It's already happening. In California, Florida, Connecticut, and Utah, which have passed laws that cap the amount that can be collected for surprise billings. And other states have websites that allow patients to compare pricing for common procedures. It's safe to say that not only is our care going beyond the four walls of a hospital, but so is the entire buying experience. In 2017, it's not just about improving your clinical performance, it's also going to be about who has the best customer satisfaction. When we talk to our members, they know the entire patient experience is key. That's why they're constantly sharing what works with each other through premier collaboratives and virtual communities. Together, we are accelerating new standards of the total care experience for consumers so that they choose the most valuable organizations.